It's Daniel of Young and Foodish. When I first visited the famous Bagel Bake on London's Brick Lane, I was struck by two throwbacks. Bagel was spelled B-E-I-G-E-L. It wasn't a bagel after all. It was a bagel, a transliteration of the Yiddish bagel. Even more archaic than the spelling was the lack of variety. All of the bagel bake bagels were plain. No sesame seeds, no onion flakes. Nothingness was part of its identity. Some 30 years later, just as Beigel Bake was finally introducing a seeded option, I was developing a fondness for the plain bagel. Bagels are traditionally made with a malt component, barley malt syrup or malt extract. Without surface seasoning to enhance a bagel's taste, I could fully appreciate its cereal-like sweetness and toasted, almost caramel-like aroma. Becoming more attuned to the fundamental flavor of a bagel has only increased my appreciation of any bagel layered with cream cheese, tomato, lox, onion, capers, dill, the works. In food, as in music, it can be rewarding to master the quieter sections before you send in the trumpets.